New developments on a disturbing animal cruelty investigation. Police have taken two more dogs away from the man accused of abandoning this malnourished canine. Moses was in such poor health, he had to be euthanized. Investigators say his owner's other dogs were in good shape, but did not have their shots. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lance joins us now live in North Providence. Mike Bryan, Kenny's two dogs are inside this North Providence animal shelter. Officials say they're in good condition, but they do not have their rabies shots. Less than 24 hours after North Providence police arrested 47 year old Brian Kenny and charged him with a misdemeanor for failure to provide proper medical care for his ailing elderly dog Moses, who had to be euthanized. Kenny faces more misdemeanors for his remaining two dogs. Ignorance is no defense of the law. Rhode Island SPCA President Dr. Ernest Finocchio says a public outcry from Moses' death prompted the return of North Providence animal control officers to Kenny's house. They discovered that his two other smaller dogs, one of them a Pomeranian, did not have their rabies shots. Both were taken and brought to animal control shelter where they'll be vaccinated for rabies. The sad thing about it is, uh, is that once the dogs are vaccinated, Mr. McKinney can get his dogs back. Dr. Finocchio says Kenny faces two new misdemeanor charges for failure to get rabies vaccinations. Each carries a possible fine of anywhere between $50 and $500 and up to 11 months in jail. I would venture to say that over 50 percent of all cats, dogs and, and ferrets in the state of Rhode Island are not vaccinated for rabies. The law, it's not being enforced. Finocchio says within the last few years, there have been an average of two to three cases just like Moses. Reporting live outside of North Providence Animal Shelter with the Northwest Mobile Newsroom, Shante Lands, Eyewitness News.